Welcome to another episode of Julian Tech TM and it's, it's freaking raining. So we're gonna do a tech under twenty dollars. Oh, oh god, it's raining. Okay, we gotta we gotta go. We gotta go. This is Julian and welcome to Julian Tech TM. I actually did an intro, but then it will rain in Simlim Square. But never mind. This is tech under twenty dollars bought in Simlim Square, and I have a special guest, a tech noob. So you can. <laughs> So the first product we have, P&G Mini Portable Wireless Speaker. Oh. If you look at it, it, it the branding looks like what? Look, the logo looks like JBL. <laughs> like JBL, right? <laughs> you look at that. This is 1990 for uh, wireless. That's nice. Ah. Okay, so this is the TNG wireless speaker. Is it like it looks like from the picture? It looks like it's expensive. It, it, it looks very matte. This looks like a very cheap plastic. Cheap plastic, yeah. What it matters is how it sounds. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. While waiting for it to charge, we can actually compare this to like a actual JBL okay. wireless okay. speaker. Same color, or no? Look at that. Yeah. One is Man. premium. Yeah, yeah. The other is plastic. Ooh. Oh my god. Bluetooth mode. That's the same sound as the, as the JBL. <laughs> Is this the most uh, loudest? Right now, I'm yeah, it's the loudest. Who's this? Abby. Oh, Abby. Not too bad, eh? For twenty dollars. But it is very there. Okay, let's turn to hear the subwoofer part. Oh, so what's this for? I thought the audio would come up from F, the. F, F, F. F. Have some got a bit of the feel. Very right here. I hear no bass at no all. Bass like at zero all. bass. Yeah. Okay. The difference is a lot. Now I, I, I'm very curious. We we don't know. Let's let's check let's yeah. check this out. Let's check this out. Oh, you can hear that. You can the feel the bass. So there was a bass. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> I can really feel the bass. Oh. If this is a ten, I give this uh a four lah. Oh, four. Four because value. There's like. nothing that I like about it other than maybe I can save money. Yeah, give me a three, lah, three. Lah, I can't three, even three. enjoy the music. Yeah, it's hard <laughs> to enjoy the music. There are so many buttons, and okay, so there's a. Uh, what is it like? Lah? I don't know. Lah. Oh, got RGB. <laughs> Okay. Hey, this one cannot! This, this one, one cannot. cannot! Finally, you win something! Okay, I give you three now. <laughs> <laughs> Mouse and keyboard, how about that? Okay. So this brand is by Alcatraz. It's actually a Singapore brand. It's, this one is the only product that is over $20. Because, because, got mouse and keyboard. So I give them like, okay, divide by okay, two. Okay. And then it's like $21.90. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, like $21.90. This okay. So this is definitely not a mechanical keyboard. It's so round. It's very round, yeah. I've never seen it. It's so, so, so weird. Um, e. It's marked to be USB wired keyboard and mouse, 1200 CPI optical mouse, slim and low profile, UV coated keycaps. Means like the ultraviolet lights won't harm it. I don't have no idea. What, what, what is that for? Ultraviolet lights, so you can be protected while like, under the sun. You can bring to the beach. <laughs> <laughs> It's a membrane keyboard. Membrane yeah. keyboard. Unlike a mechanical keyboard, which mm. is each key has its own buttons, this is like a whole main board and you're just pressing a rubber oh, to no connect the, 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 the key. You can't complain lah for $20. Uh, one more thing we should unbox before we go to the next product, which is a mouse pad. The story with this mouse pad and um, learn from my mistake, when you want to find something cheap, right, and you're in Sydney Square, go everywhere. Because I found this for $19, right, then I go to another store they have something very similar for like $12 so what do I mean by similar it's worth to get one that's like threaded okay. on the sides if it's not threaded right when you use the mouse it will kill these ones are those cheap cheap ones so you can see at the sides right it's peeling off already oh. so once you keep using right and then it will just see yeah it will peel off very easy look at that I mean this is a cheap one so it's fine but this one cannot because it's threaded Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now you feel the mouse. How does it feel? How does it feel? Don't like it so far. Why? Uh? First thing is, I, I don't like how this is very... um. You feel this? I like something matte. Oh, that has a grip. Right, the glossy finish. Yeah, the glossy finish doesn't make me feel like I want to hold it much. Oh, the, you, if you can feel right, the bottom part of it, uh, it's not very good also. It feels very... It's very... It's all friction. Uh. Yeah. You know, we test an uh, expensive mouse with a cheap mouse pad. This is the Logitech Super Light Pro. It has one of the best like bottom surface. It looks smooth. Yeah. You Ooh. try. You try. Got difference, <laughs> right? Got difference, right? No. Okay, Julian from the future here. Uh, you know, I test the mouse a little in another video and it was not good at all. There's a delay if you move the mouse too fast. So I'm not going to recommend this set of keyboard and mouse. One star. Sorry, no. 
No. Okay, back to the video. Okay, so this is a multifunctional work light. So when I saw this, it is a $20 or rather $19.90 porch light, which is actually quite expensive for uh -huh. a porch light. But the reason why I bought this is because of some of the functions. Firstly, it's an L-shaped porch light, so you can put it in your pocket mm. or you can like hook it here. So you can just like, you know. You can hook it. Yeah, oh. You can hook, you know, like so I can, let's say I'm working, right? You can hook and then I can turn it on. Not too bad. Okay, yeah. Or let's say if I have a side pocket, I can yeah. put it on, you know. There is the, this. Uh -huh. Yes, yes. Uh -huh. And that's not all. The bottom is magnetic. Whoa. Right, right. So you can have like a spotlight, do you work, or you can like have a bigger light, like a lamp. Not bad, right? I would say this is a... No, that's not all, that's not all. That's not all. You can unloosen this. Angle it, and then it goes to a, a different angle. And you can loosen more, it goes to an even different angle. Do you need to see how the angle looks like? Uh, wait. If it's here, right? See just now? Uh, now it looks like it's 45. Can you see? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, you know, usually how you charge things. You have the cable, right? Mm. You got a USB like that, man. Don't need any cable. I guess in a way it can be annoying, but it can be very useful because you don't need a cable. You just plug it into it. Can use already. Not bad, right? Huh? 10. 10. <laughs> Finally a 10. I really That's like this product a, a lot. I am I, I give this product a 10 also. For, for a tech under $20, this is actually very useful. You know when we build a PC, we need to cool uh. the CPU? Uh -huh. uh, but we never think about cooling the human being. This is a standing fan for your desk. Okay. Okay. This one costs, I think, $19.90. One thing that is great, rechargeable, got different speeds. I honestly give this like a six. I would say I'll give it five. Mm. Just nine is fine. But will you will you buy this? For picnic. Picnic. But not for my desk. Eh, can you leave it? Can you put it? Uh, okay. Uh oh! Whoa! Oh, oh, you give can. me a six already! <laughs> six! You got a six! <laughs> okay, very There you nice. go, picnic. Uh, this is good. Next product, Velcro for six dollars. That's it. <laughs> okay, next thing is, uh, I, I cheated a bit. This is the Moro 2200. Uh, it's actually $30. I actually got this for $10. Wow, oh, how? On Amazon. So it's not really from Sydney Square. Okay. But this one teaches you a lesson. If you see something that you like, check it online, whether you can get a better deal. Okay. There are speakers under $20. There is the this exact same thing without the subwoofer. Oh, one thing that is good about these speakers is powered by USB. So you don't need an external power source to... Mm. Ah, show, show the camera, the speakers first. Okay. There's three parts to these speakers. I think this is the left and right. And then this is like the main sound where it's coming from. You can control the bass and the volume over here. So, and it has a nice color finish over here like it's bronze and looks a bit premium I like I like how it can adjust the bass mm. but the, the, the thing is this is an actual desktop speakers and the JBL has better bass yeah as you much know? as you can adjust the yeah. bass let's go to your song to see the clarity of yeah. the song Not bad actually. Quite not, clear. Yeah. Clearer than this guy. Definitely lah. Anything <laughs> is better than this guy. The bass music is not bad. Not bad. The bass music. With Metallica songs, right? You you want like good speakers with that kind of music? Yeah. Because there's so so much more. Like there's the. There's the drums, the drums have the hi-hat, the snare, the bass, and then you have the basses, you have the guitarists, and mm. you have the vocals. So you, you kind of need all-round good sound. Whereas okay. this one seems to be good at the mids to a bit of the treble. Okay. Bass is a bit weak. A song like yours, which is a bit more chill, treble, mids, it sounds better. Uh. Not, say it, not say it sounds great, but it sounds better. So to you, is uh, this is not bad. This is not bad. I would say this is six. Okay, okay. Will you pay $30 for this? No, I will order online and buy it for $10. The $10, yeah. 10, and, yes. And, okay. I said five, right? But for $10, if you can find this for $10, or even uh, 6.5 because of the value. Okay, but like, if it's a 30, no. Yeah, no. 30 is a bit. 
This one is the commercial brake product. Uh, USB hub. This one is uh, fourteen ninety. What? You got not enough USB? You buy this. Okay, this one I want. You can have it. <laughs> but it is something that I want. Last product H one 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 gaming headset by Logitech. Logitech, bro. Okay. I tell you, yeah. I would think right for someone that is that that wants to save money, this is quite attractive. Below twenty dollars, eh? Okay, Logitech is a good brand. Yeah, but so the look, come on. Nowadays, the modern style where you look like a gamer, this one, you look like a telemarketer. You can test this out with one of Razer's sharp headset. I forgot what, what exact model is this. Okay, let me let me test this out. <laughs> I, it's not covering the whole thing. It's very... <laughs> the thing, here's the thing. It's very light. It feels like I'm not wearing anything. <laughs> okay. But you know what I feel like? I feel like, hello sir, can I... <laughs> can I... <laughs> Trouble you for one minute to talk to you for the, our product. Yeah, it's, you look like a telemarketer. Yeah. <laughs> Let's try watching gameplay because this is a gaming headset. Not, not, nothing to do with music, right? <laughs> that is loud! It's loud. I didn't expect that. You know what? It's not too bad. Audio quality, like in terms of gaming, I'm hearing all the footsteps. It gives me the information I need. So you can hear where is your opponent. Yeah, yeah. You try, you try. <laughs> it feels slanted, I don't know why. It's not very comfortable. Yes, I know that you can hear the footsteps, but I like the sound to be in my ear and I feel like the certain audio is being escaped because it's not covering my it ear. It is lah, it is. But to be honest, for 1990, I was expecting a lot worse. Let's try the Razer. Headset. This one is actually one of the lower end entry level headset from Razer. I really only like it because of the comfort level. Okay. That's different. <laughs> <laughs> That's different. I think it is important for all the sounds to really go into your ear and not outwards. There is difference. Okay. There's a mm, yeah. mm with the sound. I can hear everything nicely. I'm I'm in the in that game. I I don't feel I'm like distracted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like or uh, discomforted. In a way, how I will put it is that this does the job. Gives you where the enemies are coming from. But because it's this kind of design where it's not closing your ear, that's a, if your if your background is noisy, right? It, it brings you out of the game. Oh, this reminds me of what? What? Uh, those internet cafe back then. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Correct, correct, correct. Internet cafe. <sighs> you wear this, you, you can smell the instant noodle. <laughs> Someone is cooking, then there's someone playing it's like CS or L4D. Yeah. This brings you out of the immersion of the game. Whereas when you put this on, uh, and this is not noise cancellation. Yeah, it's, it's just, not. It just ca covers your ear. It just feels like you're you're in the game. Yeah. Oh, okay, like, honestly, I, I give this um, in terms of value, audio quality, everything, uh, five. Because it labeled it as gaming. Yeah. So the if no gaming, just headphones. Yeah, la, yeah. I will give a uh, five. But because you say gaming, I'm sorry, I'm a one. I give one. Why? Why? One is because at least I can still hear one. But, but why one? Why why because gaming you give one? There is a lot of expectations as a gamer. Certain style, certain aesthetic, oh, certain comfort. Like the style, okay. I This I, is I a gaming it. headphone. This one is headphone. Okay. If headphone is fine. If a gaming headphone, one. I, because for me, right, when I, I try to put myself in the perspective of a uh, primary school kid or secondary school kid that you're just trying to find a headset for cheap. You're, you're, you ask your mom, Mommy, uh, can buy for me the Razer headset? Mm. You sell a uh, $100? Mm. Oh, uh, Mommy, $20 for headset can. Uh, can, 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 you know? Uh, then this is what you get. <laughs> Favorite product? Your torch light and the speakers. Mm. The subwoofer speaker. Uh, for me, it's really, yeah, this is this is worth it. Like the yeah. only thing that I realized is worth it. I, as, I, I think the thing is, we we are quite spoiled also. Uh. We haven't been using entry level product for quite uh, some time. Yeah, also. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we our perspective is a bit more spoiled. Okay, before we end, let's let's make a setup out of this. So there you have it. Pack under $20. I hope you enjoy this video. I took a break for quite a long time, so this is something new. <laughs> what do you think of, of this experience? Interesting. Uh. Huh? I think uh with every item below 20 you still can game you still can you know mm. start at the entry level but yeah this is interesting anyway thank you for joining me thank you Redon. watch my videos uh, i have uh, a channel i got inside i'm one in one of them what types oh, of yeah, people yeah, waking yeah. up there are types of people in the morning oh in the morning mm. yeah we see crocodile so yeah. thank you and i am done say say we are done
And we're done. We're done. One, two, three. We're and done. We're done. Next time, don't be late for the show. <laughs> okay, done. This one really must censor. I want you to close your eyes. Bring up, bring up your your hands. I'm uh, sorry, I said I didn't have hands that. Close your eyes. Why is that? <laughs> so what are you supposed to do with this? Please describe what this product is. It's a uh, rubber. Now what is it supposed to be? And uh, looks like a book. It doesn't feel like the real book, man. You feel before? Ah? <laughs> we don't have we don't have comparison. <laughs> <laughs> Let's, <bring it. laughs> Let's have a comparison. Okay. Smell like what or not? It smells like when you open a new pack of Pokemon cards. Oh. Right. Oh. Right. What? Maybe from the same factory. Wait, how you know the smells wow, what a weird it's very accurate the way you describe it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs>